and we're shooting at ISO 200 when we're shooting at ISO 100 yeah f*** it oh, I'm fucking sick of talking this f***ing camera shit evening guys welcome back to the channel so the plan is shoot the first light of day hitting the Rohini mountain range out to the west there it's probably to the position I want to be in it's probably a 15-20 minute drive in the morning so uh, there's no uh, there's no getting up at stupid o'clock my initial thoughts are I shoot that with the Nikon D3S coupled with the Nikon 200 to 500 f5.6 and I think that's just going to draw the main peaks in beautifully I'm not sure if there's going to be any cloud on the tops it says it's going to be quite a clear morning I'd like there to be some uh, some crowd swirl <laughs> I'd like there to be some cloud swirling around some mist uh, but we'll see we'll, we'll see there's no snow on top of the uh, the mountains at this early stage in the game uh, that's for that's for later on as well all right guys so uh, let's get some sleep and we'll crack on in the morning see you later guys when I said there's no need to be getting up at stupid o'clock welcome to stupid o'clock turns out when I was setting the alarm last night it is in fact daylight saving so the clocks go back an hour fall back for oh geez, fall back for autumn that's what we've just done woke up bright and breezy wide awake at what would have been 4.30 a.m because the clock went back, it's 3.30 a.m. So I've been sort of, uh, yeah, played awake, buzzing most of the night. Not a great sleeper anyway. Almost 5 a.m. Sunrise is 6.31 a.m. So I've got an hour and a half to kill, which is okay. I can get a coffee, sit down, chill out for an hour, have a steady drive to the location, and, uh, and we're going to see how it goes from there. I'll sort the Nikon out, get that all set up, and well, it's absolutely crystal clear out here. We've got a little bit of cloud on the eastern horizon, looking out west towards the Rohini mountain range, which is the subject of this morning's photo. It's crystal clear, other than we've got what I was hoping for, which is a, a, a thin layer, a small layer of cloud running over the top of the peaks and it looks pretty cool actually. This side of the mountain range is quite sort of up and flat and even and there's no sort of major peaks to focus in on so I'm just going to have to see what I can get around because this, this mountain range runs for 100 kilometres down the central spine of the North Island and from different angles, different areas you get distinct peaks. There's one down down the way, maybe maybe another 40 minutes down the down the road there, just near a little place called Takapau. You get some you get some nice distinctive peaks there, and that's I'm going to save that though because uh, that always looks better when there's snow on the top, and you get the uh, the first glow of sunshine hitting that. Waiting a little bit longer. We're still in dawn. Not much going on to be fair. Waiting, waiting, waiting. And there's a couple of nice peaks that I want to focus in on. We've got quite a lot of uh, grumpy, hungry, horny cows out there by the sound of it. Don't think they'll bother me too much. Beautiful morning, absolutely stunning morning. So I'm putting the focus right into the right into the mountain peak there. Let's give this a little bit of a test there. So look at that one. Oh yeah, and that is looking very nice. Still awaiting sunrise. I'll just check what time it is actually. We've still got about another 20 minutes to sunrise. I think the two areas I'm interested in, that peak there, and across here, these two peaks here. So I'm gonna kind of zoom in and isolate those two peaks, or three peaks as it is. I think they will make some nice photographs. That is looking gorgeous. Got some nice detail in those peaks. But it's going to be even better once that sun gets up. The first light starts hitting that cloud and that mountain face. I think we're in for a quite a nice, quite a nice little shoot. 
and just uh, I'm, I'm kind of I'm actually buzzing because we're just into April now and we start getting snow round about back in the May June so quite a while to go before we get snow on the top and uh, and when we do I'm going to be spending quite a lot of time down here I, I just love it I just love these mountains cannot wait we're just starting to get a beautiful pink in the sky this shot at the moment is absolutely it's, it's gorgeous it's gorgeous absolutely oh. it is beautiful loving it loving it to bits okay looking good guys looking good oh. I'm buzzing for sunlight but these oh man this looks stunning this is shooting at 200 mil and i've just got that main peak that i want in there and, and let me just assure you if you can hear some uh, quite grunty noises going on that ain't me that is that is stunning guys that is really really that's a beautiful shot okay i'm just going to zoom into 500 just to bring that peak right in there i just want to get the peak right front and center with a pink sky behind man 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 You see, without this, we've got a crystal clear day, obviously, it's going to be a beauty. Without the early morning cloud on the mountain tops, it'd be bland, it'd be boring, there'd be nothing to see. But with that cloud there, oh, <laughs> it is just, oh, that's quite a nice peak. We've got quite a craggy peak towards the right hand side of the range there. And that is just starting to, that is looking stunning. Loving it, absolutely loving it, loving it, loving it, loving it. I'm scrambling a little bit to try and set the video camera up so you can see the first light of day hitting the mountain peaks. I'm hoping I've got to focus on it. What I don't want to do is mess about with the video camera and miss this absolutely beautiful, beautiful light. That is, oh man, that is perfect. This is going to make a nice little sequence of photographs. That, that glow in the sky, that glow in the clouds, that is what they call a little bit of alpine glow. <sighs> Tremendous, absolutely fantastic. It's going to be hard to pick an absolute winner, an absolute hero shot. These are looking absolutely spectacular. Let's just bring this into 500. Got a little bit of mist sliding me on the face of the mountain there. I'm just trying and get a shot of that wow it's absolutely spectacular so that guys is a wrap We're probably 10 minutes after sunrise the range is bathed in beautiful sunlight now but the color in the clouds has gone it's quite ordinary now so uh, i am more than happy with the photographs i've got there this morning beautiful beautiful shoot that's been a long night and an early morning well spent. Lovely, lovely shots. Hope you enjoy this, guys. And uh, if you do, you know what to do. From New Zealand on what's going to be an absolutely cracking, cracking day. Hope you enjoyed this. And uh, until next time, catch you later, guys. All the best.